Hi, I'm Carrie. I'm the artist who drew these puppets, and I can't wait to see where you bring Fox and Owl on their epic adventures of Fox and Owl. But what if you need other characters in your story? Well, that's why today I'm going to show you how to draw your own Nature Neighbor puppet characters. I can't wait to see who you draw. First, pick a Nature Neighbor to be a character in your puppet show. I'll show you how I did this with Fox. First, you're going to do some research. If you have books, you can research with books or you can use the internet. First things I notice, looking at the fox, fluffy cheeks, they have pointy ears, dramatic eyes, and pointy snout. Next, research what they do. I looked up favorite snacks, their diet, what they eat, favorite places to go, their talents, their adaptations, their habitat, their biggest worries or challenges living around humans. That will help me figure out their character of what they want to do in the show. So next, step three, draw. You want to bring out the drama of their looks so they really show up as a puppet. So the pointy snout here, I drew that there. Also standing out are the pointy ears. I drew the pointy ears. Then I really want to show the dramatic eyes. I made those big. And also the fluffy cheeks and tail. That makes it really look like a fox. So finally, I'm going to um, color it, cut it out, name it, and action. Then I can um, tape a stick to the back, and my puppet is ready to go and play. So first, you'll pick a nature neighbor. Choose someone that you've seen around your neighborhood. Let's say I want to choose a possum. Next, I want to research how do they look and what do they do. That will help me form not only a great looking puppet, but a good character. I notice they have cute little round ears, an oval body shape, pointy snout, and short legs, but a long tail. So I'm drawing the main features of my possum. I remember that it has a pointy snout, cute little round ears, um, an oval body shape and short legs but a long tail. Right away that's giving me a clue that that's a possum. This is just my sketch. You can use this Draw Your Own Nature Neighbor Puppet Character planning page to help you gather information. So then you're ready to draw your final draft. My seven-year-old drew this one. Isn't it fabulous? We've got the pointy snout the cute little round ears, oval body shape, short legs, long tail, you can tell it's a possum right away. He did a great job. So you can cut out your drawing, tape it to a stick with some tape, and now, magically, it's a puppet. It's ready to play and be part of a magnificent show. <laughs> I can't wait to see what fabulous characters you're going to come up with to add to the epic adventures of Fox and Owl. And thanks so much for being part of the Fox Festival this year.